All right, guys, here in the Mabuhay bus with RJ, Cypher, Sahara as well. We're heading now to the vet. Sahara is going to get her next round of shots and Cypher is going in for a checkup. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping everything is okay. Hey guys, welcome to my daily vlogs. Please subscribe. Here at the vet. Yes. Alright guys, back from the vet and um, all looks well, health tests great, A-OK. -okay. Sahara got her next round of shots. She still needs a few more, so she won't be able to, you know, run outside or go for a walk with Cypher for a while. They've both been dewormed. I, I don't want to look at their poo this morning or tomorrow, gross. Um, but everything is A-OK. -okay. I'm so happy about this, guys. Love having healthy animals. Good morning, Mabuhay Squad. A brand new day. It is a Wednesday today. Ooh. And I am wearing my dog shirt. It says Dog Dad. <laughs> the bestest ever dog dad. From Mabuhay Squad Richard. Hi, Mabuhay Squad Richard. Um, thank you for this shirt. Love it. Along with the other things that were sent. Unbelievable. Have you guys seen that vlog where Richard, a Mabuhay Squad, sent us a box of things? OMG. Like crazy the craziest box we've ever received go check out that vlog guys So if you watched yesterday's vlog I asked you guys to help us choose an official logo for ciphers coffee, which I'm drinking this morning Mmm, um, I hope you guys managed to vote now. Here's the thing so two of the options were really close in fact one option was winning and then all of a sudden later another option caught up and surpassed that option and like they're pretty close so Arjun and I talked about it and we're like okay what do we do because a lot of you guys liked one a lot of you guys liked the other and we're still monitoring the numbers because it was just uploaded yesterday the vlog and you know the results can change at any time so Arjun and I talked about it and we're like you know what we should hold another voting session for the finalists because yesterday there were 13 finalists for the logos some were sent in by you some were created by us on our end and you guys cast your vote and so we were like okay you know what today we need to do a secondary voting session to vote for the logo of our official brand of coffee which we are launching if you're new um, guys, we're launching a new brand of coffee. This is a coffee We've been working on since last year quarantine. So it's been one year in the making RJ and I are really proud of it I particularly am proud of it. I've been drinking it every day since last year uh, You know the process took some time to you know perfect the blend because as you know Not all coffees are made equal and so I wanted you guys involved in this whole launch of the coffee yesterday we had held our official vote for the logo and of the 13 there were a top three that stood out among the rest and we felt like we definitely should hold a secondary vote because maybe having 13 options wasn't exactly fair for all the options because like let's say you couldn't watch the whole video and see every single uh, logo and so you guys just voted for whatever you guys saw in the first few logos you know what I mean like maybe the later logos had an unfair advantage so what we're gonna do today is I'm going to show you all three logos one two three they are our finalist logo options so you guys can vote again just to make sure this is like an are you sure type vote so we're gonna present those to you now along with that I figured you know what maybe to help you guys vote I'll also talk about the aesthetic of each logo like depending on what logo is chosen it will affect how we do product photos of Cypher's coffee how we do any future commercials uh, for online for Cypher's coffee it will affect basically how we present Cypher's coffee to you on camera and on screen and to help you guys vote I will try to act out <laughs> a sample photo and maybe model it for you um, or maybe even act out a sample kind of like commercial peg how about that huh it'll be like America's Next Top Model challenge style. Ooh, I'm excited. I mean, you know, it's obviously the product and the quality 
and taste of the product is the most important. That's what will carry the success of the product. Mm, and it's there. But also, what helps a product succeed is the branding. You know what I mean? Like these little things, like how you present it in photos, how you present it in promotional videos, that kind of thing. Because when people will be consuming our product, I'm not assuming that only Mabuhai Squad will be drinking this. You know, obviously us, when we drink this, we're reminded of us. We have this thing. There's an understanding. We know what we're about. You know, your daily dose of positive vibes. But for those who aren't Mabuhai Squad, who don't watch the vlogs, that might get to taste this, we want to give them a sort of like image in their head. So there's kind of like a recall. You know, when you think of Cypher's coffee, maybe this image will come to their head. So I'm going to portray the various images of the three top logos that you guys chose that I was thinking of. Okay guys, so here are the top three logos that you chose from yesterday, yes. Congratulations to all of you who had a logo that you chose. These were definitely the top three and I was really happy with the top three. Um, and so have a good look at them. And after I demonstrate what I envision for their pegs to vote again, all you need to do is go to the pinned comments of this vlog and under it, there will be option one, two, and three. And all you gotta do is hit thumbs up on the option that you guys like, okay? All right, let's get to it. Logo one. You guys absolutely loved this. In fact, this logo was the number one option for most of the night. We, were, RJ and I were watching the numbers, watching the polls, and this was in the lead. Um, even my mother voted for this. She's, my mother sent us a, a message and she was like, Michael, choose this logo. <laughs> Um, a lot of you guys expressed that you could instantly see it, you could recognize it, you know it's a coffee brand. Um, the moment you lay eyes on it, uh, you could see it from afar, like if it was shrunk down, you could still recognize it. So a lot of you voted for it and it was in the lead. Now, if this logo becomes the official logo for Cypher's Coffee, tell me if this is what you guys feel. So when I look at that logo, I think retro 60s diner. Like, you know, like Dick Tracy type Chicago type feels. You know what I mean? Like, I, I just see retro and people in trench coats like this and like top hats. You know what I mean? And they grab the drink and they have a sip. So I was thinking that kind of thing. What do you guys think of that? So if I were to see a commercial, I would see some guy in a trench coat sitting up at the, at the diner, you know, the retro diner in the 1970s or 60s and pretty lady serves him the coffee and he has a drink and he removes his hat and he looks to camera and is like, your daily dose of positive vibes and then has a sip. <laughs> what do you guys think of that? Hmm? And then the pretty lady behind the bar goes, yes, honey, <laughs> or something, I don't know. All right, so that is logo number one. If you have any other recommendations for a peg, let me know, like when you look at logo number one, does it make you feel a certain way? How do you envision the ad campaign, the photos, the commercial, the ad video? Let me know in the comments. Okay, logo finalist number two. This logo was in third place and I'm glad it made the cut because it was very, very Baguio. It was very representative of where the coffee beans are from, which makes Cypher's coffee quite unique. Now for this, I envisioned something more like in the mountains, something that most people would consider almost like Canada. So I'm thinking sweaters, toques, like this, scarves. I also you had to dig through our winter wear because I haven't put this on in years. By the fireplace in a log cabin um, up in the mountains with pine trees. Can you believe that there is actually a place like that here in the Philippines? Baguio City is like that. It's quite cold. I mean, it doesn't get below freezing. It doesn't snow, but people wear this kind of stuff there. It's a very unique location in the Philippines that not very many people realize exists, you know, in a tropical country like the Philippines. So yeah, holding that coffee, smelling, mm. Guys, I can't wait for you guys to smell Cypher's coffee, by the way, sorry, off topic. But yeah, smelling the coffee, mm. Having a nice taste of it, mm. Oh, and like 
a roast chicken, like cooking. I don't know. Mm, I, I smell chicken. You know what I mean? And I, and I smell firewood burning and that kind of thing. Your daily dose of positive vibes. Mmm. What do you guys think of that? Oh wait, I also foresee Ifugao and like Igorot artifacts and cultural items in the background maybe hanging on the wall to give it that Baguio feel as well because I mean it's a representative of like Filipino mountains and pine trees that kind of thing. There needs to be a Filipino element to it as well. Yeah, that would be great, wouldn't it? So that is option two. All right, guys. Again, if you guys feel something different when you look at the logo of option two, just let me know in the comments. Now, in terms of option three, this is, well, at the moment that I'm filming this today, it's currently in the lead. It was also one of my favorites. I really like the look of it. For this, I wasn't really sure as to how we would design a campaign ad for this or like promo photos, but one of the things that I thought of, so picture this, it's a a darkened temple. Oh, boom, boom, poof, poof, it's dark. There are torches hanging on the wall, right? It's a very, it's a secret like society, right? And it's brick, everything is stone. And we go into this darkened temple. It's all Zen, mm, um, right? And then at, we're walking up to this sacred temple and all of a sudden, we look and a beam of light, of sunlight is coming down on this temple. And what is it? It's Cypher Coffee. And then one of the, like, I don't know, the monks or like whatever, the people who are there worshiping, <laughs> removes his, his hood and it's me. And I'm like, your daily dose of positive vibes. <laughs> and then I grab it and I drink the coffee. And everyone parties. It's not actually like this like sacred ceremony. It's actually a big party. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do you think of that? I don't know. I mean, sky's the limit. Let me know in the comments. And if you're part of the majority that have voted for this logo, feel free to vote again. Now, in this case, because there are only three options, before yesterday, I told you you guys could vote for more than one option. You can if you want, but I recommend that you try to choose your top one, like your most favorite of the three, just so the results become more obvious. But if you absolutely can't choose one, go ahead, choose two. Just don't choose all three because then the results will be like too similar and it'll be hard for RJ and I to choose a favorite. Hope you guys enjoy this voting session. And again, I can't wait for you guys to try Cypher's Coffee. I mean, in the end, whatever logo we choose, it will be ours. This will be our official Mabuhai Squad Coffee. Mm. And then I can't wait for all of us to Again, synchronize, drink it together. That day's coming, guys, when I'll be like, all right, Mabuhai squad, grab your cypher coffee in a cup and let's drink together. One, two, three. Ah, can't wait for that day. It's time for our positive affirmation of the day for Wednesday, March the 24th. In my relationships with both friends and lovers alike, we are equals. We respect each other's decisions. There you go, guys. Hope you enjoy today's positive affirmation. I swear, this thing's psychic. We respect each other's decisions. We just did a poll. <laughs> wow. All right, guys. You won't believe what I just discovered. Wow, wow, wow. Mabu High Squad. I was just looking around when suddenly something dawned on me. Check it out. <laughs>